Hello strangers, welcome to Albert Reads the Hits. I am Albert Strange, and on this installment of The Secrets of the Number Ones, we have the first number one song from the 1980s. It is uh, KC and the Sunshine Band. The song is Please Don't Go. It was number one from January 5th, 1980 until January 12th, 1980, so it was, uh, it was one week at number one. Um, KC and the Sunshine Band had uh, several hits in the 70s, several number one hits in the 70s. If you're not familiar with the band, uh, itself, you are familiar with some of their songs, believe me. Um, they sang uh, Get Down Tonight, you know, Do a Little Dance, Make a Little Love, Get Down Tonight. They uh, sang That's the Way I Like It, and uh, Shake, 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 Shake Your Booty. Those are just uh, a few of their number one songs. They were they were real hit makers in the, uh, in the 70s. Um, again, they had the first number one song in 1980. And uh, they broke up a week after this song hit number one. So I think that's a, a bit of a microcosm for, uh, for disco itself. They had a bunch of hits with disco songs uh, in the 70s. When the 80s hit, they had their first uh, number one song that wasn't a disco song. The song is a love ballad. Um, and then they broke up. So, you know, the, the 80s killed disco. And the, this, uh, this band also just... Um, didn't, didn't last uh, once the 80s started. The song itself was written by uh, Harry Wayne Casey. Casey spelled C-A-S-E-Y, not K-C, like, uh, like in the band, but that is Casey. And uh, also uh, Richard Finch. And uh, they, were the, they were the primary songwriters for the, uh, for the band. Uh, let's, um, let's go ahead and get to it, though. Uh, Please Don't Go by uh, Casey and the Sunshine Band. I love you, yeah, babe, I love you so, I want you to know that I'm going to miss your love the minute you walk out that door, so please don't go, don't go, don't go away, please don't go, don't go, I'm begging you to stay, if you leave, at least in my lifetime, I've had one dream come true. I was blessed to be loved by someone as wonderful as you. So please don't go, don't go, don't go away. Please don't go, don't go. I'm begging you to stay. Hey, 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 yeah. Babe, I love you so. I, I want you to know that I'm gonna miss your love the minute you walk out that door. So please don't go. Don't go. Don't go away. Hey, hey, hey. I need your love. I'm down on my knees. Begging please, please, please. Don't go. Don't you hear me, baby? Don't leave me now. Oh, no, 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 no. Please don't go. I want you to know that I, I, I love you so. Please don't leave me, baby. Please don't go. And that's it. That's uh, Please Don't Go. Obviously, his, uh, he has upset his lover, his girlfriend, wife, whatever, uh, whatever the situation might be, and she's ready to walk out that door, and he's begging her to stay. I think we've all been there before. <laughs> But um, I, uh, I did not realize that this song, I, I, there have been several covers of this song. I, I was, once I started reading the lyrics and listened to the, uh, the original version of it, I realized that I was familiar with this song. Um, not the song itself, but um, covers from, uh, from the 90s. Um, I looked it up and there was a, a couple of uh, covers done both in, uh, in 1992. Uh, one by a French pop band called Double U. Uh, not like the letter double U, but double, like double there, double U. Uh, and then a British band called KWS uh, did a single, did, their, did a version of it also, and they were both dance pop songs. Um, the French version, uh, or I should say the W version, uh, went to number 25 on the Hot 100. And uh, the KWS version uh, went to number one in the UK, uh, but in the U.S. Uh, Hot 100, it made it to number six. Um, there were some legal difficulties between the two bands. 
Um, not going to get into it here. It was very confusing from what I read. Um, but I also read that um, the the British band KWS they uh, they were on a uh, British variety show called Top of the Pops, and they managed to upset Elton John, uh, which I don't think is anything that you ever want to do, especially if you're an artist. Um, when they they were both on the same episode, and KWS had the nerve to take the dressing room number one. So uh, Elton John was relegated to dressing room number two. And um, he wasn't happy about that. So <laughs> when uh, I don't blame him. I can't see Elton John being number two to anyone, especially a band that I'd never heard of before, uh, before finding another song <laughs> that, uh, that they did the cover of. So a little something about the, about the song itself. I don't really have much more about KC and the Sunshine Band, other than uh, Richard Finch, the, uh, the co-writer of this song, uh, is currently in jail uh, for, um, uh, shall we say, statutory malfeasance. Uh, you can look it up. Richard Finch, Casey and the Sunshine Band. Um, and that's, uh, that's what I have for you tonight, Strangers. You know, this, uh, I, I, I liked this song. Um, I liked the covers. I, I was familiar with the covers of it that... that um, I, I listened to the two, the, the W and the KWS version, and I don't think those are either the ones that I was familiar with in the 90s. I, I, I couldn't find another one from maybe later on in the 90s, like 96, 97. Um, I feel like I remember hearing it on Z104 or something. If you, live, uh, if you lived in the, the D.C. area around that time, you're familiar with Z104. Um, but, um, you know, it's, it's, it's been covered by several bands, and it's always seems to be a hit, you know. It's it's just it's it's a hit song. So uh, if you do a decent cover of it, you'll 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 chart. So any uh, aspiring musicians out there, if you want to do a cover of this song, do it uh, do it well, and uh, you may get uh, you may get onto the charts. But uh, that's again that's uh, that's all I have for you tonight, strangers. Uh, as always, do the YouTube things. Uh, like, share, subscribe, 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 subscribe. Um, I can't tell you how much I uh, would really like to get some, uh, would really appreciate if you would subscribe. Uh, you can comment, again, um, do, uh, do tell your friends, email your mom, all those things that I'm always saying. You can find me on social media, all the handles will be in the description. I'm on uh, Facebook, I'm on Instagram, I'm on Twitter, and uh, all of them are variations of Albert Strange or Strange Albert. I couldn't, uh, I couldn't make it uniform, unfortunately. And uh, lastly, as always, do remember to tip your, uh, tip your servers, tip your bartenders, tip your rideshare drivers, and your delivery drivers. They appreciate it. A couple of dollars extra on top of what you would normally give goes a long way to, uh, to making their day. So uh, until next time, strangers, we have uh, the first song from the 90s on the next uh, episode of The Secret of the Number One. It's a Michael Bolton song. That's all I'm going to say. And uh, I, will, uh, I will see you uh, next time.